Hello, I am Sue Moore, Norwex Independent Consultant, and I'm here to just talk, talk to you for a few minutes about our special car detail items. Number one is our three-in-one car mitt. Now, this is the material of our window cloth, but what's so cool, one, is it's a big mitt, so it fits on the guy's hands, too, and you have these three layers, and of course you have this one. So this is for dashboards and consoles and shining and polishing windows. So if a side gets dirty, you just flip it. If it's you know needing another clean one, and then you can flip the whole thing around. And yes, you are going to end up with six sides to be able to clean. So really, really nice mitt. Uh, my guys and gals who use this on their cars love it. I love it, I use it on my car. Now, the next couple of items I have put in this handy dandy car mitt because they make a great gift for Christmas. So I want you to think about all those car enthusiasts in your life. Basically, I am I do some state fairs and I'm around the vintage car people a lot and they absolutely love these this three duo. So this is a very large polishing cloth for windows outside if it rains just a tiny little bit but get your you know spits that dirt onto the car so then you can just get the car wet and and you can polish it now the nice thing about this is it's going to dry really fast does a fantastic job streak free now partner that with this fine microfiber on this side and then a buffing material here on this side. So this is, this probably for my vintage car guys, this is their favorite cloth of all time. So you can clean nicely, no scratching, no worry about scratching anything, and then buff everything so nicely with this side. Especially if you're coming out of a, like if you have a large truck, dark colored truck, and you're coming out of a car wash, uh, and it doesn't quite get it dry, this is gonna do the trick on that dark paint job, all right? Like nobody's business. You're gonna love this cloth. Now this is the car cleaning mitt itself. So one side, this side here, again, big enough to fit on guys' hands, this side is gonna work on static charge like our dust mitt does, and it's gonna pick up all the dust and, and dirt and grime from the dashboard when you use it dry, get it statically charged, and then go do your dust dash. Then when you want to clean the outside of your car, of course, we're going to stick this in a bucket and we're going to go cleaning and the little chenille nubs get into your grill, get into your car tire, um, all of that. Okay. Your rims and everything going to do a fantastic job. So again, this makes an amazing gift for yourself or for that loved one that loves their car. Okay. And I won't say just for guys because we all love to have our cars look really nice. So those do a fantastic job. Now, I'm going to show you one other thing that I really, really love, and that's our handheld cleaning system. Let me grab it from over here. So basically, this is, again, the window polishing material. That's on a small mop pad. Then we have the dry mop pad, again, for dusting across the dash if you want to. And then this, of course, is our wet mop pad, which you can get wet and do your windows. So let's imagine that I've done that to my windows and the handheld system pops onto this telescopic mop handle. But it's actually less expensive for you to buy this handheld system, which is really nice. All of those are interchangeable on the Velcro. And then we also have this little brush on the end. Okay, so this is nice around the radio, dashboard again, console, that kind of stuff. Okay, so you're going to be able to get all that dirt and debris up where you can grab it with a cloth. Then uh, I can pop it off of this small handle. And when I want to reach up high, I'm going to be able to put it onto my mop handle. And what this does is it reaches six feet. And so what's really cool about this, if you think of RV siding, uh, even being able to get across your uh, windshield without climbing up on something, all right? So imagine I've cleaned my windshield and now I just want to dry it. So this is going to come across and again, leave this streak free, chemical free. We could eat off this windshield if we wanted to, 
all right? So before I would do all that, of course, I would wash the windshield. This is to polish it. But that whole set comes together in the handheld system, and then you can just buy this mop handle separate, or maybe your spouse has a Norwex mop and she would loan you the mop handle. So either way, you can get your own mop handle or do it, do it like that, share it, okay? So now what we're gonna do is take a look at cleaning our headlights. And one of the things I'm gonna show you is my seven year old scrubber. This is actually a dishcloth, you guys, because you can use it in crock pots and all that other stuff. It does not come in white any longer. It comes in this graphite color. But in white, I've gotten this wet with just water. Then I'm going to grab my cleaning paste. And my cleaning paste is non-abrasive. This is non-abrasive. Everything I've shown you is non-abrasive. So for those vintage cars and just your Primo, like if you have a Ferrari or whatever you drive, you know, Corvette or whatever, your baby, right? These products are not going to harm them and they are going to last a long, long time. You have a 60 day money back guarantee and a two year warranty on them. But like I said, mine are over seven years old, you guys. So um, and that's like washing and using them probably at least once a week. All right. So this is crushed marble flour, coconut oil and a little bit of natural soap. So I got this wet. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use a little bit of an Enviro cloth along with it. So this is just a wet Enviro cloth. Again, no chemicals. And then I'm going to show you the dirty um, headlamp. And I'm going to take this and I'm going to just rub it in here like this and get a little of that cleaning paste on there. We're going to go to work on some bugs on the front. Let me uh, change my, make sure you guys can see this. Hang on and uh, get down there a little bit closer. Okay, there we go. So now I'm gonna hit the light because I, if I think I hit the light, you guys will see, you'll be able to see a little bit better. Let me see if I see better from this side. All right, I'm sorry about that, but I'll get you in there where you can see how dirty it is. Yeah, okay, there we go. So we're gonna take this with just a little bit of water again, and I'm gonna come in here Yep, I'm gonna clean that headlight. I'm gonna clean bugs off. There's some bug right down there. Yep, comes off super, super easy. Get the bugs off and everything. And you don't even need very much. That's what's so amazing. And if they're caked on there a little bit more than this, my next choice would be the Spiri sponge. So again, just get it into your cleaning paste and get scrubbing on that. But I think my uh, dishcloth actually did the trick. But like I said, if it's a little more buggy than this, then you can use that uh, Spiri sponge. Now I'm just gonna come right here and wipe that off. And oh my goodness, oh goodness, these headlights are amazing. And then of course, if I wanted to shine them, I could come back with the window cloth or I could come back with my handheld system. But for this shape, it's easier to probably use this cloth or use the, if you know, if we're out here doing our car, my other choice would be, uh, I could grab again this car cloth to shine that, okay? So there you have it. And uh, let's turn the lights on again so you can see that just for a second and uh, just does a beautiful job of getting those headlights clean. It really does an amazing, an amazing job, you guys. And I did all of that in my dress because there's nothing that's gonna stain or ruin my clothes or anything like that. So again, Norwex, the promise, is that you're 100% satisfied. Thanks for watching this. You can go to my website at susanmoore.norwex.biz. I would love to partner with you to help you continue to create your safe haven in your home and in your cars. Thanks, and RVs. Don't forget your RVs. All right, bye.